Hey guys, what is up? This is AJ170. Now today guys, I'm going to be showing you how to record your full screen without the red bar. The red bar that normally shows up on the top of the screen when recording actually takes up space from your screen like it'll actually take away like a good inch of your actual screen guys. And inside this video, I'll be showing you how to get rid of that and replace it with a blue bar. That blue bar lasts for about 30 seconds guys. So with that said, can I get 170 likes? Also, if you are new, support the 170 and subscribe. So with that said, let's go ahead and jump right into this video, guys. First, I'm going to show you what it looks like, and then I'm going to show you how to do it. Okay, guys, so I'm not going to edit that this video that you're currently watching, the, the one that's on the screen right now, the, the little screen recording. Uh, so as you guys can see, there's only a blue bar on the top. Now, the blue bar does not take up any space, and it only lasts for roughly, I want to say, about 20 to 30 seconds, guys, So which isn't that long. I was having some trouble opening up the app because I wanted to show I wasn't jailbroken. That circle right there means I am not jailbroken. If I go ahead and open up City, as you guys can see, it does crash. And if I continue to try and open it, as you guys can see, again, it crashes. And then the blue bar disappears, and then there you guys go. So if you really wanted to, I mean, that was probably maybe 15 seconds right there. If you guys really wanted to, you could probably even go and wait 15 seconds to start the video if that blue bar really does bother you. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to do this now. Okay guys, so I am using my jailbroken screen uh, screen recorder so I can actually record this guys. So if you go ahead and open up video, you want to keep device and f uh, microphone audio off. You want to select device screen. Now this is completely optional, you guys don't have to do 1080p and 30fps. I mean, I recommend doing 720p and 30fps because you don't really need the full 60fps and you don't really need full 1080p. 720 looks basically ex the exact same. And then basically after you guys hit done, you're going to hit done a few times, slide up, select airplay. You guys should see video AJ's iPhone, tap that or well it'll be whatever your iPhone is called. And then it's going to automatically start recording. Now it, the, my recorder crashed uh, as soon as I turned that on. I don't know why guys. But that is how you are going to want to do it. It is really simple and then you can just continue on recording. Now a very important thing in order to get this app there will be a link inside the description of course and also guys probably one of the last things is when I use this recorder my internet stops working on my iPhone that is it so I can go on any other device that's going to continue to work. Uh, for me the way to fix that is I have to reboot my device. Now one of my friends Flame Master 500 he was one of the testers and he said his internet worked perfectly fine and he was on iOS 10. Now I had Spectra test this heels on iOS 10.2 and he said it worked perfectly fine. He sent me the video and everything. When you guys are done recording, you'd slide up and you'd uh, basically change your airplay over to your iPhone or whatever it says. And then it's all it's going to say recording stopped and then the video is going to automatically get put inside of your guys' library. It's as simple as that to use guys, but that's going to be about it for this video guys. This is AJ170 signing out. See you guys next time.